Hey, it's Mike again. If you saw my previous video, you'll know I've got a KK2.1 multi-rotor controller board from Hobby King to replace the KK2.0. I thought I would do some testing with my 450 size quadcopter. First, let's do some testing with the KK2.0 with the version 1.6 firmware. Then, let's test the KK2.1 with the same firmware. Here's the KK2.0. It's a little gusty today. Watch the flag and listen to the mic for wind gust. We got a gust of wind right here. Let's try to fly this thing a little bit more aggressively. Okay, so that was the KK2.0 with the 1.6 firmware. Now let's try the KK2.1 with the same version 1.6 firmware and the same PI settings. Okay, first we'll do some hover testing. It had a little bit of wind right there, that's why it was kind of vibrating some, uh, jiggling a little bit. Let's try it again. Started getting windy. Seems much more stable in a hover than the other one.
Well, I knew my low voltage sensor is working. I think the KK 2.1 flew pretty well. I didn't notice a huge improvement. It did seem more stable in a hover, but I got a little wobble. Perhaps I need to do some more tweaking of the settings. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to subscribe to get reminders for future videos.